Hello, great people. Hello, great Biafrans. Hello, great Biafrans. Join me again today. Uh, this is a very, very uh, emergency broadcast. Very, very emergency broadcast. And there is something that I want to talk about. And we have to talk about all this. And I want you to go to the article. Go to the article. I am addressing the idiocy in Asari Dukubo and his criminal lifestyle. You will hear a lot of things. You know, Asari Dukubo said that uh, he will begin to bring out a book. I don't know the book that he want to bring. I want you to join me quick. Join me quick, my people. Let us talk about this. It's very, very important. I have a 80 leaves here. 80 leaves book. Let me show you people. 80 leaves. 80 leaves book. Here. It's 80. It's all about Asari Dukubo. By the time I get to the, 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 the first line, Asari Dukubo will fall from where he is. I hope every one of us have listened to the video of the rest, the recent video of Asari Dukubo. That is why you have to listen to this video and share it. Let us go. Uh, because we have to listen to Asari Dukubo. And before I will go to this issue, telling people, let me call the name of people. Izuna, welcome to the program. NG Okoye, you are welcome to the program. You people should write your name, let me call. It's going to be a quick one. This one is going to be also a quick one. And the things that you're going to heard from me today, there is no lie about it. And it's all about Asari Dukubo. I don't lie about what I'm saying. And there is a proof. That is a video that I'm going to show also. So that you people will know that what I'm saying is not lie. Okay? Uh, thank you, my people. Sonny, you're welcome to the Sonny. Okay? You're welcome to this program. Um... Shishi, you're welcome to the uh, program. Hi, my brother. Hi to you, my brother, too. You are my brother. If you call me brother, I call you brother. Thank you. I want people to write something. Let me call their names. <clears throat> Who is Nonso? You're welcome to the program. Nonso Dominic. Thank you. Um, what is your name? Engineer. Uh, Wisdom. You're welcome to the program. Ushenna. You're welcome to the program. All uh, right, right. I want to call the people that are... Um, Isuchuku. Moses, you're welcome to the program. What is the name? The uh, This thing is a little bit far away. Uh, King Solomon, you're welcome. David, you're welcome. Thank you, my people. I should write on. Um, David, say I should write on. Uh, thank you, Marzi. Uh, Kano, you're welcome to the program. Ekesin, you're welcome to the program. Uh, engineer, once again, thank you, my people. Uh, Kano, what is the name? I have to come a little bit closer. to so Stanley, you're welcome to the program. Uh, and Avo, you're kind of, you're welcome. Uh, Jay Kennedy, you're welcome to the program. You people should write name, let me call. Write on, uh, who is this? Uh, is a, is a, um, no, I can't call this name, please. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, why I'm here today, uh, this one said, God bless you, Mazi, be a French child. Thank you, may God bless you too, my brother. May God bless you and your family. If you can be able to say that, I say, this one say GCK, don't flex. Thank you. Uh, Becky, thank you. Izuna, you're welcome. Anyam, you're welcome. Um, Namde, Shinya, you're welcome. Freddy, Magzi, you're fre we're welcome. Prince, Shisum, you are welcome to the program. Stanley B, you're welcome. Thank you, my great people of Biafra Freedom Fighters, lovers of freedom, my great people all over the world. We are going to listen to Asari Dokubo, not all the whole trash that he was vomiting out from his mouth. Um, we are going to listen to the video that I just quoted because I don't want to play all the whole things that he was saying because what is coming out from Asari Dokubo's mouth is something that is a, 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 is an abomination. We have to say things the way it is. It's abomination. If Asari Dokubo can open his mouth and say that kill all the beer from people, kill all the IPOB. And he have forgotten that IPOB means the indigenous people of Biafra. You see? And um, there is a lot of things that I'm going to say today that Asari Dokubo can never deny it. He can never... And I have a proof. You know, my own is not like, uh, you just said. I will bring a proof 
then you will begin to know that every allegation that these people are saying that Asari, Asari Dokumbo is taking place on is true. And anything I'm going to say about Asari Dokumbo, you will begin to understand that there is no lie about what I'm saying. Because there is a proof there. You know, I myself, like the way I always tell my people that I believe in reality, give me something that I can be able to see. What I'm saying is seeing text message, article, video record, and etc. So that I can look towards it and reason as a woman. Because believe in me, I have that inability to reason. Of course, I have it. So I can be able to reason and understand what is going on. And what I'm going to show today will shock all of you. What I'm going to say today is going to shock all of you. And there is no lie about it. I'm going to call some names too. So when they doubt, you will go and ask them. And they will confirm that what I'm saying is true. Nothing but the truth. Because I'm coming here to tell you the truth. Let me also introduce myself once again. And as you are coming, you know, Asari Dokumbo video now is going viral. That is exactly what Asari Dokumbo want to achieve. He wants his name to be back again. And that name that is coming back, there is a lot of things behind that. And I will clear it to our people for them to begin to understand that Asari Dokumbo is working with the, the Fulani. Asari Dokumbo don't have anything Biafra in his heart. All this one that he's claiming that his name is Edi Abane. And I also want Asari Dokumbo to go and make research on Edi Abane. What means by Edi Abane? Because that man is a very stupid woman being. He, don't, he knows nothing. Oh, just on African Bolombolo. Just on African Bolombolo, we're not called Otos, we're there. But Asari Dokumbo think that we are coming here for Biafran restoration with the with the Kana Akwea emotionally. We are not coming here for that. We are telling our people the reality. That is why I always stand here to tell you the reality. Let me introduce myself for some of you that are watching me for the first time. I still remain the Biafran child in Wachineke. Maso Kechuku, the general. I am from Ihala in Anambra. Anambra is Biafra land. And I am under command and control of IPOB. I am oath member. That is why I'm telling you, I am not in any, I am not a principal officer. I am not occupying any position in IPOB, but I am in media. That is what Mazen Nandekano gave to me. He said that go out there, preach to our people. You have that capacity to tell people what they want to hear. That is the reason why I'm here today. Now, if you never get it, you have to get it now. Don't misquote me. I am not a. I am not one of the leadership. All these people that are uh, 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 IPOB uh, making laws and they dishing out the orders for us to carry, I am not part of them. I am not among them. I am not closer to them. They are my leadership. I listen to them. I take their order. Whenever they give the order, I will help to spread it to our people so that they will hear it. That is my job. I hope you people are getting me. Before you people will come tomorrow and say that a uh, uh, Bia franchise is giving order. No, I don't give order. I don't know even though when they set up order. So now pay attention. Asari do kumbo no se no mooka. And the two se ku ya na bi him na ku no be zoku. Today I will be try as possible as I can to be able to lower my voice the way I'm using it this time around so that people will get every single thing that is coming out from my mouth. But I want to be cool today. Okay, uh, uh, and I will explain everything. Asari Dokumbo is evil. But before I will proceed on this thing, because I don't want to be seen, so that people will not say, uh, you have come to deceive our people. Mostly of our people are saying this, but it can never work for them. Now, I want us to pay attention on this audio tape of Asari Dokumbo. Not all, I caught it. So that we would caption that place that he was mentioning. You know, because sometimes I will be saying this. Some people will say that, be a French child. Don't say this. Stop saying this. It will cause a problem. That, you know, it seems that there is some people that have that monopoly. You see? Because that is exactly what I'm seeing today. There is some people that they have monopoly to say that I will kill you. To say that go out there and begin to kill people. I begin to see it in Asari Dokumbo. There are some people that have that monopoly. But we are saying that 
Everybody also have that monopoly to tell people go and kill. When some people will be calling on my, on my program saying that, hey, can I Some people will be saying, don't say that. But you see Asari Dokumbo opening his mouth saying that, go and kill all IPOB. Go and kill them. We can never allow Mazen Namikano to come out. And when I will say it, they will be telling me, oh, yes, whoop, whoop. Does it mean that, that some people have the monopoly and others don't have? That is what we are fighting on this struggle. We are coming for everybody. We, what we are trying to achieve at the end of this Biafran restoration, for everybody to be equal. You cannot come to tell me that now nah, you are, you are you, nah, you be, you give the give the No, you can't tell me that. If you push me, we go to law court. We present our case. This is exactly what we are trying to say. We are not trying to say, uh, We are, our plan at the end of all this restoration of Biafra will be, Ugobere, Nkesi, Beyebena, Nkukwan. This is what we are fighting for. We are not fighting for people to come here and be telling you that I'm Ogidibo, Ogidibo, whatever I said is this. You see, we are not here on that. I am telling you people the honestly speaking. But now, I don't want to talk too much. Before I will begin to present the dubious act of Asari Dokumbo and the, his idiocy and his criminal lifestyle, I would like us to listen to Asari Dokumbo. And there is a video that I will bring again, then I will shock you people before I will begin to tell you people what behind all these things. So that you will begin to get a point. Because one thing you have to do is begin to follow everything that I'm saying one after the other. I will show the broadcast of Asari Dokubo, the latest one that is going viral, because that is exactly what he wants to do. He wants people to begin to see him, I'm back again. I am the one that put Mazen Namdekan to where he is today. Of course, Asari Dokubo hand is there. There is no lie about it. And you will hear it with proof. We we'll believe on proof. Not you, you come in pataka. Or you come in a koinyo. Now, pay attention to Asari Dokubo. No be me talk about Nasari. Nasari talk about. No be me oh. I went to court, to the Supreme Court. I stood that I am the leader of Niger Delta People's Volunteer Force. I stayed in prison. I did not beg. No, 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 no. He's begging. He's begging that he's not IPOB. And you are justifying it. He is not IBOB, program. He is not IBOB, kidding, kidding. He is he's a coward. What was he doing in Kenya? He went to collect money. So he went alone. You people that are following, in America, it's another for one night. Oh. You did not ask him what he went to do. You were not aware that he was in Kenya. You accused Okuba Sari of betraying him. Am I a member of your organization? I told you before time that I would smoke him out. I told you before time that anywhere in Ambikanu is hiding, me, I would smoke him out. No be mad, no be shy to me. I will smoke him out, I will bring him, and I've done all that. I'm not going to deny that that demented little uh, or I told you that I will smoke him out. And now I'm more resolved because with what I have seen, what I have read, wow! How can somebody do this to our own people? Can somebody do this to our own people? How can this devil do this to our own people? Even if it is Buari that we, I will support Buari, I will catch him, I will catch all of you. So don't bother your head calling me this. Thing. I'm not your member, so how do I betray you? How do I sell you out? I'm not I'm your enemy. I've been your enemy. I assisted, I trained you. What did you pay me for? Lies. You paid me lies. You, I should shut up. I never shut up. Please share the video. I never please. shut up. Share the video. Because I know no, that if you coming. come, you will be in your grave. And I want you people to also understand that is their plan. Jealousy. You got it. Jealousy is what we kill as Arito Kubo. Jealous 
okay? And as Sarido Kumbo came out and said that uh, Mazin Nambekano denied being the leader or member of IPOB, you see how these people are peddling lies, deceiving our people, concocting stories and fabricating lies against the leader of indigenous people of Biafra, Mazin Nambekano. All these things that Asari Dokumbo is saying, our leader never denied being an IPOB member. He never denied being the, the leader of IPOB. I keep on saying this. That was a question true to Mazen Namdekano. If Asari Dokumbo don't know, let him begin to know. I want us to make this video also go viral because what I will present today, it will shock every one of you. I told you people I have a fort, 80 leaves. By the time I will get only to, to the first one, second one, Asari Dokumbo go the hear them. And do people go the open on a mouth that they say, how? And it's all of, all this thing is nothing but the truth. Our leader, there is a question true to him. Are you the leader of terrorist groups called IPOB? Are you the leader of proscribed IPOB? Mazin Namdekan said to them, I am not a member or leader of proscribed, which is a terrorist. But when you say, well, if you can ask me, because you know, they want to use a place to lay their foundation. I mean, they want to put, I mean, they, they want to have a safer ground so that when they will begin their all this evil prosecution, they will know where to hold him, hold Mazen Nambekano. But the problem is like these people don't know that Mazen Nambekano is so intelligent. You, you cannot just ask person, are you a, a, a leader of terrorists? And the person will say, yes, I am. What is that? What kind of question is it? Are you talking to a baby they just, the, a two years baby? You are talking to the leader of the largest movement on this planet Earth. So he must defend himself. We are talking about judiciary. Where the case have been, uh, uh, you have to complain your, 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 your case and they will look into it and make the judgment. So you want Mazen Nandekano, as Sari Dokumbo is telling Mazen Nandekano, he should accept that he's a terrorist. You see, you see the evil in our people. This is not the, uh, this is not the beginning of, I never start because what I have here is uh, the book of Asari Dokumbo. Ezi, Asari Dokumbo. This is his book. By the time I get to the first page, second, Asari, Asari will understand because he said that he's coming. Before Asari, before you come, we will come. You see? Let us continue. I have cleared this to Asari Tokubo. Mazin Namdekanu is the leader of indigenous people of Biafra. And he is also a member. He never denied anything. Even though the media rooms in that zoo called Nigeria have carried it. They have explained more better. I don't know the daft. Asari Dokumbo claimed that he went to school. Asari Dokumbo claimed that he knows it all. Asari Dokumbo claimed that he, he is an educated person. But the way he voiced out, we know that he's a bonkon. Asari Dokumbo is a bonkon. You see? But when, when, when I'm saying all this, and people will not seem to understand. Eh? Bingo's everywhere. Only what you know do is to look in things for your own self, for your own self, as I did to is fighting for your own self, with the families. Pay attention, let us listen more. Every essence in Igbo land is against you people. There is nothing in support of you. Only some idiots are supporting you. Every essence in Igbo land is against you. You show people, people, cannibalism now. A native doctor tell you that when you shop people, it's okay. I will send avalanche of video to you. I am beginning. I have begun already. Line. I have begun already. You, <laughs> you can never you come, come back. That is your problem. <laughs> this is so I am not bothered about you. I am 58 years. Uh -huh. 70 years old. Mm -hmm. I will reach 70. I will reach 90. Mm -hmm. I allow. Hey, then you are praising this fellow. This, this thing, are they not true? You people are fighting yourself already. The thing Chinas and uh, all of them are doing, is it we that are telling them, they are shopping money, they are kissing each other, they are spelling each other. They, you are due ass. Pay attention on this. 
because I want you people to be, you know, to get my point one after the other, so that when I will break the coconuts, you will get every single sound that will drop on the ground, okay? All this thing that Asari Dokumbo is saying, eating money, shopping money, that is the propaganda from Simon Eber. He is the one that they have pushed this agenda to him. They told him, go out there and begin to siphon and deceive our people, be calling names to the OS, say all manners of things. People will help you to promote it. And that is why Asari Dokumbo picked up from there. All the things that Asari Dokumbo is saying today is from Simon Eber. There is no two ways about it. Because that is the job they tell them to continue. And they have getting paid. Uh, they are getting paid every single day on this job they are doing. From UK to the model. Okay? But I will tell you people, what is the root? Because I believe on the root of the problem before to solve the problem. But at the end, we are going to solve this problem. Biafra must come. Whether they like it or not. And there is no dictionary. There is no mercy. On our dictionary, he said, "He said true." A lot of people have asked me this thing. Abu kwa tumori shenge. Udo di yale ukugodo buka chukunya na yaka kailu eba yenaga. All of them we face judiciary, you know, because we are not going to begin to. We don't. We we are not killers. All this thing that Asari Dokumbo is saying is to show you the evil in this man called Asari Dokumbo. Asari Dokubo, you see, you see Asari Dokubo, that is why he's living today in that zoo called Nigeria. Have mansion here and there. You will hear it. You will hear the evil in Asari. Not me, I'm not the one that will say it. It's a man that also comes from that coastal region of Biafra. We say it from his mouth. You will begin to understand. Not me. Not me. My own is coming. After the man own, my own will follow. Then you people will begin to understand that everything that I'm saying, is not is accurate there is no lie about it because we're going to listen to a man and also a state person from coastal region telling you about asari Kumbo that you should beware because it's coming ediaban onyoshi asari Kumbo don't know the meaning of ediaban all this one that you saying that this one name is take the name from lie is lie Asari is a criminal because Ediaban means a criminal. I don't know what you people call it in your place, but in Igbo land, Ediaban means a criminal. Onye obunabu onyoshi. Onye nagana aban is Ediaban. A criminal. Onyoshi, for that matter. Coming here, talking all sort of nonsense. Now he's happy because the video have gotten to everyone. He will be looking the video, maybe if they have gotten to 300 or something thousand viewers, ah, eh, then he will begin to jump up because they believe on that everything we are doing is only on social media. They are like, and I call it everywhere. You think that these people have common sense. You think that they reason at all. Asari Dokumbo that just breathing from his anus. Because that man, I don't know what, I don't know where his sense is. Asari Dokumbo just think about all his stomach, how he will get more bigger. That when you come to Europe, you will see that those rich people, you couldn't see any belly on their day. You know pothole. Asari Dokumbo carry pothole everywhere. If you look at Asari Dokumbo body, upon all the richness he, ha he, 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 he is, and all the whole stolen wealth that he have taken from people, you look at your Akorokoreju Arunine, Korokoreju Asari Dokumbaro, upon how rich he is, upon how many mansions that this man have. If you look at his skin, skin and the Ebe, Ebe, Ndipina, Bed poor good today, you know, wire to and tie. And the Asari Dokumbo will open his thinking mouth and be talking all sorts of nonsense. Then where is that money that he has? That he can't even maintain his body. He can't even look clean. Oh, you pray for the Kebe, Ebe, Ebe, Ubu, Chinch, Jido, Jigo, and we are wire to my tire. This is it. And we're going to finish listening to this before the next one will come. Let us pay attention to Asari Dokumbo and say and hear what he said from his mouth and before I will bring the counter person that will come because we have everything we don't lie pay attention to is the kumpo on ala from 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 amani boss you are DOS look you people always celebrate and deceive the people that uh, have your state court of first instance has given him judgment are you talking to illiterates Court of Appeal Court, Court of Second Instance, federal government, the government of the Nigerian state will not appeal. 
what of a uh, uh, court of final instance will you go? They will not agree to it. You are just deceiving people, mad people everywhere. Mad people everywhere. 419 everywhere. Idiots everywhere. Who is 419? I need to Every IPOB member in Ibo land should be killed by Ibo people. Hunt them down and kill them. Don't show them mercy. They are worse than the devil. They are worse. Now, you, have you begun to understand? Have you now begin to understand? For some of you that will call me on phone, when I will get angry, be saying that, yeah, you are telling me I don't have to say so. But now you begin to see that some people that have that monopoly to open their mouth and say that you should kill the whole indigenous people. What are we going to say about these people now? Okay, they are in that position to say something like that and nothing will happen. And when I will say something like that, people will be use my name to carry a, a mission and they will target on me. And you think I care? Or is it what you think? You think that is a, you think that killing, 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 you think that it's only you know how to kill. Only you know my case, woman. Only you my case, brewe. Other people, now you have a way. There's no other people can talk. Whenever they say something, you don't have right to say your mind or how you feel. Asari Dokumba will come out to say that Mazen Namnekan will die in jail if Nigeria leaves him. And he opened his thinking mouth, Ezebida. Just Ezebida that never washed his body. Asari Dokumba don't think that this man is taking shower at all. Because believe in me, how heavy that idiot is. Do you know that Asari Dokubo know they see his dead boy this thing again? Mamoki, you know they see him again. Asari Dokubo can never see his mamoki and I will tell Afia like this. I say when you have a on a mogene. Idiot. Pay attention to Asari Dokubo. Then I will bring the next video to you people. Stand the devil. If you Let see the atrocities, you will not believe it. All those political prostitutes, political leaders who are going about thinking that they will have political capital out of this tragedy, this, this tragedy of genocidal proportion in Ebola, may God punish you. May, 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 may the IPOB and ESM visit your family and kill them the way they killed uh, uh, this person, Akine Lu's husband. Dr. Akine Lu, let them visit you and kill you. Okay, my people, now you people have listened to Asari Dokubo, what he said. Because I don't want to be playing all the whole things that he have been saying. He said a lot of things. But what the point that I pick, or what makes me to come into this video, when Asari Dokubo said, remember, Asari Dokubo said that uh, it's not part of us. Of course, Asari Dokubo is not part of us. Asari Dokubo is a betrayer. Asari Dokumbo is a is a is a Asari Dokumbo is fanatic about this their religion of jihadists. Asari Dokumbo is one of those that they want to use to carry their mission, because they have promised Asari Dokumbo that he will be the emir of the whole eastern region. Asari Dokumbo accepted, like the way they went to Shina Sangoro to take Shina Sangoro to take over Mazen Namdekano, and he rejected. They went to this Irima in Finland, idiot. And he jumped out, say that, uh, yes, I can take the control. I'm not lying, it is, it is there. When Nelly Ofebu said, she said, she said that I spoke to Shina Sangoru at the end so that he can be able to work with someone else. <laughs> this backyard. You see, I want you people to understand this, that I am not joking, I am telling you the truth. But now, I want you to see before I will open my own shutter, I want you to hear this man now. This man is from Ijo, and we're gonna see his face. Why I don't show Asari Dokumbo is a video, but I want you people to see to hear it from audio because this man uh, seeing his face is like seeing the monster himself, the evil himself, the Lucifer himself. I don't want to show it on my screen to be on this page. That is why. On my own video, I mean to say on this my video because we have already shared his uh, where he was bragging. Now bragging, and I call you. Now call you, no, just they brag. 
You see? That is the evil that is in Biafran people. Now I will, I will put it to everybody. Not only Igbo, 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 but to Biafran people. Jealousy. Now you go kill some people. Jealousy. Jealousy, jealousy. Why, why, why is you? Why, why is you? Makagini go to everyone get one. Why is not me? That is the problem of Asari Dokubo. And you will hear a lot of things that this man is going to voice out from his mouth. Then, when I will open my shutter, or my shutter, then you will begin to understand that I am not lying against Asari Dokubo. And the reason why Asari Dokumbo is voicing out now, I will still let you people know. Because some people have used it against us before. Say all manners of things to us. Asari Dokumbo, all of them, both to Simon, all of them, they are doing the same thing. They are the people carrying all this uh, attack, killing people, destroying people's properties. You think they don't know what they are doing? Of course they know what they are doing. They want to keep our leader there. Don't you hear what uh, our bro our father uh, Mbazurike said? That some people in IPOB, some leaders in IPOB, they are making the case worse by sitting at home. Like uh, Mbazurike don't know. Or if that man is tired, you know, see me here. I am not coming here even though you are an older person. If you don't know what you say, I have a zero. No. There's no two ways about it. Okay, okay, okay. Come to Europe here, some people that are ruling them today, they are under for something years old. So what are you think? What, what are you talking about? It's only in Africa they will tell you this man is old man, he knows everything. Mm, if you don't know what you are saying again, you go and sit down. I'm not coming here to abuse you. You cannot say that you never heard that IPOB leadership have cancelled sit at home. Why are you referring to IPOB? You don't know the people that are doing all that thing. You know. And you yourself, you know that we have cancelled it. And you are saying that there's some IPOB, leadership in IPOB, they, they, are not, they, they don't want to sit at home. Like those people that are parading themselves are IPOB. You don't know. You don't tell your, 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 your Igwes and the, your people that uh, this is not IPOB. Like you don't know. I don't want to go there, but it's okay. It's okay. I'm going to okay, 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 you mess something about Zeyonu. I'm going to ask you something about Zeyonu. I'm going to ask you something about Zeyonu. Before them, we kept an answer and can even now with life. What I'm saying to you is life. There's no two ways about it. You have to ask, and you know who are those people that are doing it. I have said it here. It's Simon Eber and Nelly Ofebu, Madame Oibo and Bridget. All of them, they are in the same basket. I don't count anybody out, even though they have a problem in their family. Who cares? They are all the same people. Because if they are not, why did they not understood all this thing when they just started? How? How did they come together to be one people? And now they have divided. So there is something going on. Because if they know what they are doing, they could have been still up to date to be together as one people. But they are not. Because there is something going on the ground. Maybe now they are trying to push some people, do this now. These people will say, no, I'm not going to do this. So you want Biafran people to kill me? Then problem begin to start let us go to the video of this man the man that will vindicate me when i will begin to to show up uh, my last uh, where is this video just wait my people i downloaded the video it's coming now the video is coming the man that will vindicate me about everything i will say about just wait just wait we have to see the face of this man now. We will see the face. It's a long video also, but I'm not going to show all. I want to show the beginning of this video when the man said, who is Asari Dokubo? That is something that I want you people to pay attention. Not me. Pay attention. Um, it's, it's, it's quite unfortunate that um, Alaji Asari Dokubo will come online to question the powers of His Majesty of the King of Bonny Kingdom. It's very, very unfortunate. No wonder one Mr. Cotel from the Calabari normally comes online to insult Asari Dokubo. And of most time I keep attacking Mr. Cotel. But the position and words of Asari Dokubo today has drawn a conclusion 
why that Mr. Cotton is always lambasting and attacking him. First, I want it to be on record that His Majesty the King did not impose anybody, did not impose any chief on the Finima, on the Brown House people. If Asari Dokubo cares enough to know, he would have asked questions. He would have done his findings. But of course, I know he's also an interested party in what is happening. I know one of the masterminda of the attack in Finima. In Finima. To the Boni people and the chief of Brand House. Are you listening? He's a strong ally of Asari Dokubo. Strong ally to Asari Dokubo. And of course, yes. he's coming on social media. Uh -huh. You know to posit okay. in his support. Okay. In However, yes. Asari Dokuba who claimed to be a stakeholder in the Nigerian. Now pay attention. Even though he has betrayed us yes. over time. Oh yes. Even though he sold us the job <coughs> youth council. Are you listening? Is it to build mansion in, in Dubai. Dubai? In Dubai. He has also joined forces in seeing how the the Indam the Kano and all of that. Are you he listening? has a questionable issue that we cannot even come here to are you people, I hope you people understand what this man said. I hope you people understand. I'm going to repeat the video again. I'm going to repeat this voice. Pay attention, please. Pay attention and listen to every word that's coming out from this man's mouth. Before I will bring my own, because I have my own. I have, we have saw what Asari Dokumbo said about us. And you will listen again what this man said about Asari Dokumbo, how Asari Dokumbo betrayed the youth of Ejo. How Asari Dokumbo was one of those to plan to, uh, to kill Mazen Namdekan. Asari Dokumbo. Are you beginning to understand what I'm saying? Let us repeat this video because it's, uh, it's very, very important. Because you see me, I believe in reality. I don't believe, say, bala, bala, bala. When they call you to come and explain how this thing is, you have to come and explain. You don't have to be running to Shirai and begin to ask Shirai, what are the lies that you have done? It's something that you're going to do. Very small thing that have shaken you. One of us that we have been in this struggle for years, they have said they have paid me. They, why I did not go to Shirai? I will keep on defending myself because we are talking about reality. We are in reality. You present yourself. Come to challenge everything, accusation they are giving. You have to come and challenge it. You don't have to go to Shirai. Why are you going to Shirai? You don't have mouth again to say something. You have to come and prove and defend yourself. Why are you going? Why are you running to Shirai? Okay, you have tired to speak. You never speak at all. You never say anything at all. But you are running to Shirai. Going there calling my name. I don't know why you are calling my name. All the whole bullet that I've been taking every day. Do you think I have called call anybody? Do you think I will take anybody to Shira? I will keep on calling them. If they doubt me, they have to come. Let's sit on a round table and discuss this. If they, if, if they say I'm lying against them, then we will prove it. Let us listen to this man once again. Then I will bring my own. Because my own, like I said, is 80 leaves. I will open only one chapter today. Only one chapter. I will open for to Kumba today. As time goes on, I will begin to open it. By the time I will get in the middle, as I do the combat, we finish. He will voice, he will come out and tell you people everything plain. Let us listen to this man once again. Thank you, my brother. Um, it's, it's, it's quite unfortunate. Yes. That um, Alaji Asari Dokubo will come online uh -huh. to question the powers of His Majesty. Of the King of Bonny Kingdom. Okay. It's very, very unfortunate. All right. No wonder one Mr. Cotel okay. from the Calabari normally comes online to insult Asari Dokubo. And of most time, I keep attacking Mr. Cotel. Are you listening? The man is helping him. the position. Okay. And words of Asari Dokubo today. Okay, today. Has mm -hmm. drawn a conclusion. All right. Why that Mr. Cotton is always lambasting and attacking him. Asari is a criminal. First, okay. I want it to be on record okay. that His Majesty the King did not impose anybody, did not impose any chief on the Finima, on the Brown House people. If Asari Dokubo 
Yes. He has enough to know. He don't he care. Have asked questions. He will have done his findings. But of course, I know he's also an interested party. Interested party? In what is happening. In what is happening. By to Mazen and the I know one of the masterminder yes. of the attack in eh? Finima. In Finima. To the Boni people and the chief of Brand House. Are you listening? He's a Dokobo. strong ally of Asari Dokobo. Asari Dokobo, the same man. And of course, he's coming on social media. Okay. You know, to posit mm -hmm. in his support. Okay. However, Asari Dokobo who claimed to be a stakeholder in the Niger Delta. Uh -huh. Even though he has betrayed us Betray you over people. time. Uh, over time. Even though he sold us the Joe Youth Council. Okay. He's used to build mansion in Dubai. In Dubai. In Dubai. He has also joined forces in seeing how the, the Indam the Kano and all of that. You see? He has a questionable issue that we cannot even come here to talk about. Okay. But Asari Dokumbo, according to this man, he say Asari Dokumbo have sold them time with that number. I'm not the one that said it. Because if I come now, they will say, eh, hey, now nah, be a franchise, carry and come. No, be me. The video day here. We don't see him. How Asari Dokumbo betrayed the Ijo Youth Council. How Asari, our leader was saying that Asari have mansions here and there. How did Asari get that money to begin to buy school, to build school in other countries? How did Asari Dokumbo have, get money to buy houses in Dubai, in other places in Qatar? How? by selling his own people in a job by trading on the head of his own people by stolen from a job a job they are trying to tell you because that's how they, they put this thing i say uh, development of a job or no a job cleaning it cleaning or something like that. i don't know how they put that word if somebody can write it very good to me uh, the uh, cleaning of a job or, or going to cleaning something like that up to date, the half of the money is with Sari Dokubo, buying houses here and there, traveling to to their to the, to their to to his masters. Anyhow, you see now how he, Asari Dokubo is betraying. When Mazen Namikar will say that Asari Dokubo is evil, he's a criminal. That is why I'm coming here today to debunk him, to tell you his his the stupidity in Asari Dokubo. Ogoni cleaning, thank you. O the Ogoni cleaning up. Thank you, my brother. Our people are so intelligent. Everything, they have everything intact. We don't lie here. All the whole money, ask yourself, where is that money? Asari Dokumbo is boasting today that they have this. Now, I want to go to my own. Let me open the first one for Asari. <laughs> I will just open only one today. By the time I come to the five, the page five of this book, Asari Dokumbo, we understand that we don't joke. As I want you people to understand the reason why Asari come out or came out last time. That was two days ago. The reason why Asari is out. To come and be saying that they should, they should kill all the whole IPOB. Do you people know the reason why? I saw Simon Eba talking all sorts of nonsense from his mouth. The reason why Asari Dokumbo come out, came out last time to begin to yap. I call it yap. Because... If you people can remember the, the, the first broadcast on this January 2022 of Mazi said that some people are coming from coastal region of Biafra, going to the hinterland to kill our people. That is the work of Asari Dokubo. We have busted Asari Dokubo. Asari Dokubo said no. He must come and say, and now Asari Dokubo is telling those guys that whenever they see any IPOB, they should kill them. Those men that Asari Dokumbo send to hinterland of Biafra, that is the people that he's talking to. If you see any IPOB, kill them. Are you not paying attention? Are you not beginning to understand? Because Simon Eba stay in that share, that China share that he bought, jumping up, saying that we, are, we, we want to cause a problem between hinterland and coastal region. But we are saying the evil that some of our people in coastal region are committing. Also the same thing in hinterland. Whenever you do wrong, we, co we condemn you. We, we condemn you. We condemn all of them. There's no body left. It's not because of your, uh, you are from coastal region, we are not going to talk about you. Is it only the Igbo speaking brethren is good to talk about? Is it what you people are telling me before you go on or go here? You people are mad people everywhere. We talk about coastal region, you jump out. 
He said, Coastal Ninja, we are causing problem. Who is causing problem? We are one people, we are brothers. We are family. There is no problem. We want to settle the problem between our brothers and sisters. So when you do wrong, we tell you you do wrong. You correct yourself, we are move on. Not every day say Igbo man do you, Igbo man do you, Igbo man do you, Igbo man do you. Are you fighting for only Igbo people or the Biafra is for all of us? Biafra is for Biafran people. Regardless where you come from, it does not matter with the where you, you, you find yourself. You find yourself in coastal region, you find yourself in hinterland, you find yourself part of Benio people. We are one people, there is no two ways about it. If you commit any evil, we will come out and tell the world so that you can be able to change. That is why. Idiots in the Finland jump out when they say with the cost problem. This is the reason why Asari jump out now. This is the reason why <clears throat> you people see Asari Dokumbo. Let me continue. And you know about the 20 million Mazen Nambekano said that he paid Asari Dokumbo. Some people think that Mazen Nambekano was lying. He's not lying. Go and ask Ushenna Asiebu, the former HOD. Go and ask him. He was there. He is in the meeting. We have taken him out because all of them, they are criminal. He's working today with Asari Tokubo. Go and ask him. He was there when that money was given to Asari Tokubo. All of them have connived. All of them have compromised. That is why we say, if you commit, we pursue you. If you send only two people, we remain. It's okay. Asari Tokubo used that money. Mazen Nam can give him money to, to, to build something for us. Asari Dokimbo chucking the money, walloped the money, stolen the money without doing anything, and come out in public, begin to defend lie that nobody pays him money. That is why I'm calling the name of this man, Uchenna Asiebu. Jano Joya. John Uchenna Asiebu, if I'm the Kwasi, Chukwa Boy or Kweba Ahono. I don't lie about uh, going to China. If he like, he will come, we present the whole evidence. I, I believe in uh, reality, uh, practical, and Afianya. We don't lie. Okay? That is the work of Asari Dokumbo. From there, Asari Dokumbo, the people that Asari Dokumbo built up in a, a, in a job, he carried them now, moved them to hinterland of Biafra to begin to cause chaos. Asari Dokumbo is doing this thing so that Mazen Nanikan will die there. That is exactly what they are doing. Now you pay attention. Now I hope you're listening. Why they are doing this? So that they will keep on causing havoc in our land in the name of Mazen Namdekano, like Simon will come and stay on that stupid sheer Ogrona China, begin to say we are supporting the Mazen Namdekano. Asari Dokumbona will send his own troops to begin to kill people in the name of Mazen Namdekano. Are you listening to what I'm saying? I hope you are getting the point. I hope you are getting the every detail how these people are working behind. You think they don't know what they're doing? Go there, Asadi Dokumbo send them. Go there, begin to cause problem. Kill them. And the Simon Eba will be where he is, shouting, we are the people, under the leadership of Mazen Namdekano. You see what I'm saying? That is something that our people have to understand. Don't fall for it. Asadi Dokumbo send men. When, she, when, when Mazi, uh, Shike Dosiem said it, he did not call people. Asari Dokumbo is the one behind those announcements that our HOD did. That announcement that he did, that some of our brothers and sisters are coming from hinterland to kill our people. Asari Dokumbo is the person that we are talking about. You know that Shina, uh, Mazi Shike Dosiem did not call the people. Now I'm telling you who he is. Asari Dokumbo, he is the one. Now the job where they give up. Go there, cause problem. This thing we 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 take impact in delaying Mazen Namdekano in TSS Donjon. They will because they will be bringing allegation that these people are your people. Then he will be fighting for his head, not me, not my leadership. Like the way they are saying that uh, he should accept that he's a he's a leader of a terrorist. That is exactly what they are forcing him to take. And this one now, Sarid Okumbo and Simon Eba are forcing them to keep on killing people, to be putting it on Mazen Namdekano's name. And when I said it, you think I'm lying. Use your brain, man. Just common sense. Though it's not common, but try to use it, man. Try, my people, try. Look when they see how things they go. Asarid, I want to shock Asarid Okumbo now, and I want Asarid Okumbo to come and answer us this. This is not lie. If they want... Asari Dokumbo doubt it, we begin to bring proof. And this is one of the proof. 
Asari Dokumbo and Tompolo make you people ask Asari Dokumbo how much money they paid him. Dango they paid Asari Dokumbo up to 1.5 billion. 1.5, up to 1.5 billion to guide pipeline from a job to Lagos State. 1.5 billion. That is the money that this man were, were, were telling us that Asali Dokumbo used those money to go to Dubai to buy houses. You see what I'm saying? Ogoni cleaning up. Where is Ogoni cleaning? Nothing like that. Asali Dokumbo have chucking all the whole money. He has stolen the money from Ogoni people. And Ogoni people cannot do anything until we come together to fight those common enemy that is around us before we are going to find a fight international. We have to find the internal one. Those bed bugs that are chopping us on top of our bed, like people like Asari Dokubo. Idiot, where is the bidder? That when, whenever you see the body of this man, a rich man that he called himself, a rich man and wealthy man that he claimed to be. Look at his body. Look at his body. Is he not the same Nigeria they are? Bugari have, uh, dead Bugari have traveled and changed his, his body to a small boy. Why can't Asali Dokumbo to copy what Asali Bugari did? So that he will become, uh, his body will be fresh. Upon all the whole money he has. Asali Dokumbo just shouting. Odisha no deba fuka pothole. He drug, he drug, drug, he pain so drug. I told you people, this life we are living, there is a devil. Devil lives on this earth. Devil is not a spirit the way you, you people are thinking that he is. Devil is a woman, and Asari is part of them. Asari is branch of devil. Even he, he may be the second in command. SKT. He cannot be first because Bugari is there. Garoba is there. Lailai Muhammad. You all this uh, Malami, Mapatami, all of them, they are there. So Asari Dokumbo is a still a small, he's still a small, but in that eastern region, Asari Dokumbo is a real devil. To this to our people. All the whole money of Ogoni, where is this? They paid Asari Dokumbo 1.5 billion. Some people will ask, where is the proof? So the one day this our brother said here, you he never you want me to bring you a paperwork. The one that our brother said here from coastal region, you don't hear it. That Asari Dokumbo have betrayed them, have betrayed his joy youths. He betrayed his joy youths. And he used the money to go to Dubai to buy houses. Not only Dubai. Not only Dubai. Asari Dokumbo had properties all over the Africa, West Africa. Schools and so on and so forth. That is the money. And which prove again you. Now, let me continue. I said, Tompolo, as you should, people should ask Asari Dokumbo, what he is doing with Tompolo and Dangote. What Dangote and Tompolo is doing, Asari Tokumbo and Tompolo, what are you people doing with Dangote? This one will shock them. They will say, how did you know that? How did you get to the, how did you get his info, information? I get it. Information come everywhere. We are, my ear is open to every, see, we listen. And we understand. We talk deeply. That is why we're, I'm always here, to bring you reality, not force. But reality, now I hope you are getting the point. Asari Dokumbo have been busted. Asari should come and tell us that 1.5 billion they paid him and Tompolo. I called the Tompolo. See, I said that when I will be doing, I will be calling names to you so that you can be able to go and verify if they can be able to tell you the truth. About the two twenty million. Of Mazen Nandekanu giving to Asari Dokubo, go and ask Ushenna Asiebu, he will let you know. You see, I am calling their name so that you can be able to understand what I'm saying. Those people that are next to them, they will say, ah, How this guy get all this information? Of course, I get it. Okay? That is the criminal act in uh, Asari Dokubo. The dubious, the dubious of idiocy in Asari Dokubo. And his stupidity. Claiming that he's a elderly state man. Stolen from his own people. Stolen them to dry. Ogoni cleaning where it is today. Asari Dokumbo, where he go to Asari Dokumbo premises, he's living large. All his people are dying. Asari Dokumbo will come out and begin to show you his house. Telling you which one Mazen Nam can have. 
What did he have? But we know that Mazen Namde Khan is a good person. I know that if most of us, if we are in the position of Mazen Namde Khan, we, we could have saw this struggle for a long time. Even though during the time Mazen Namde Khan was in prison, the first time they arrested him, that he was in Kuje, he could have saw this struggle. Or uh, you people have forgotten that he came with a man, not uh, Ojo Zokalo, not Kano, Ojo Zokalo. Because some of you don't understand the name of our the name of our leader. Our leader is Mazen Namde Kano. Kano, not Kalo. Kano. The one that went to Afaru Kuibe to bribe him is Kalo. Or Jews or Carlo, he went to Afaro Ibeko. After he went to prison, Kuje prison to bribe our leader. Upon say they tell our leader, go to Dubai, any place in this world, just point out, we will get you heaven on earth. Point out, don't just mention, don't mention, point out any place you want on this planet earth, we will get you what you want there so that you can live fine and forget about this Biafra. Just forget what we want you to do. Forget about Biafra. Don't call that name. We will make you rich. We will make you anything. We will give you governor. We will give you governor. And the governor that they will give Mazen Nandekan is not governor that they're going to elect. No, that's not an election. It's already selected. Mazen, you are selected. That is what they told him. Not that you are going to do election. We have already selected. Just come there and sit. Mazen Nandekan tell them, over my dead body. What I need is the freedom of my people, not my own freedom. Because Mazen Nankan can get his own freedom. They can pay Mazen Nankan for his own freedom to begin to live a free in his own capacity. But your own freedom will be in danger. That is why Mazen Nankan said, I don't need my freedom. I want the freedom of my people because Mazen Namkan knows that if his own people is free, definitely he's free forever. But if he take only his own freedom, his freedom has a limit. There is a limit that he will go. He cannot step there because if he step there, that will must be a problem. That is also things that they're going to negotiate and put on paper sign up. Your, your freedom is limited. You can't cross there. But Mazen Namde can want a freedom of unlimited. He can cross anywhere that he wants to cross. And that is the reason why the zoo said no. That is why you see Mazen Namde Kanu today. Asani Dokumbo will be boasting that he has nothing. But now pay attention. Let me tell you something. <clears throat> like I said, Asani Dokumbo have, have been boasted. Okay? But there is something I want to say on this broadcast today. That is where Asani Dokumbo was bragging. And this message, I want you to get to Asari Dokubo. He can brag all I know. All, who cares? But I want Asari Dokubo to know this. Asari Dokubo said that he have a 21 or 27 children. Isn't it? That is richer than Mazen Namde Kano. When you look at Asari Dokubo, you will know that Asari Dokubo is panicking. He know that we have already busted him. He begin to brag. We don't brag. We don't brag. But I want Asari Dokumbo to know that if he have 21 or 27 children, that Mazen Namde can have millions of children. Millions of children. Those that are ready to die because of Mazen Namde can. Those are ready to take bullets. Asari Dokumbo is only his family can take bullets for him. But there is an, some individual that they never met Mazen Namkan before that they are ready to take bullets for Mazen Namkan. And that is exactly what we're seeing today. That is exactly what we're seeing today. A lot of people are going protests. A lot of people are doing a lot of things in the name of Mazen Namkan to stop them. Who are those people? Can you, can you just ask Azari Dokumbo, who are, do, who am I? I am a son to Mazen Namkan. Let me put it that way. Because some of our people won't understand. It does not matter the age. A lot of people are calling Mazen Namikan a leader today, and they are almost 70 years older than Mazen Namikan. It does not matter. I am a son to Mazen Namikan. That is where I put it now. And a lot of you can confirm what I'm saying. That a lot of people are ready to die for him. Millions. Millions are ready to die. So Mazen Namikan have given birth to millions of people. That is why he's the leader of the largest movement on this planet Earth. All those 
all this brand, all this uh, unity units that we have, they are all royal to Mazen Namdekan. Now, are you understand that, sorry? Because I have to clear you. Because you, you, I don't know where you went your school, and you will come out and begin to claim that you are this, you are that. Then where is that your school? Where is that education that you went to to school or you were in the clique fighting for is your people? At the end, you betrayed them. Take the whole money they gave you for go to cleaning, went to Dubai and other countries to buy houses and get schools for yourself. And live and be start living large. That is only the wealth you have. As I never work in your life, all what you're doing in your life is guiding pipeline. That is your job. And everybody knows about that. And now you begin to tell us, I am Richard and Mazen Namdekan. Asari Dokuma, let me tell you something if you don't know. Mazen Namdekan is a person that don't like material things. I believe that. I believe that. Because when Mazen Namdekan begin to dress so good, like different suit, is people are just trying to tell him that you are our leader. We we get this for you for free. Mazen, we want to get it. Not that he's getting it for with his money. We we give it to you. Just do it for for us. Mazen Namikan don't like to be wearing all these things. He's just a simple person that want freedom, that want life, good life for his own people. Asari Dokumbo is there. It's opposite of Mazen Namikan because he's stolen from his own people. His job people can testify that. That is why our brother here said that. That Asari Dokumba have betrayed them, betrayed the joy youths, and there is no lie about it. And I want Asari Dokumba to know that if we can make it as a challenge, but we are praying for Mazen Namdekan to come out first. I want Asari Dokumba to understand that if Mazen Namdekan will need a private jet, he will have it. Just imagine that all these uh, uh, rel uh, religious uh, leaders. A common Pentecostal religious leaders, pastors, priests, pastors, and the uh, man of God, they, they have their own private jet. Talk less of the leader of the largest this movement that if you want, if Mazen Namdekan will need a jet, we will get it for him. Very easy. Very, very easy. Very easy. I want Tassari to know when you are talking about money, don't even go there at all. Don't even go there. Mazen Namdekan has kids more than you. And Mazen Namdekan is richer times, million times over you. Because anything that Mazen Namdekan wants, unless he don't mention it with his mouth. And I know that he will never go for those things because it's something that Mazen Namdekan will hate most. Why should I have all this and my people will be suffering? Why should I have all this wealth and uh, good life, my private jet, my 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 residual cars and my people are dying. That is what Mazen Nam can hate most. Because if he loved all this thing, he could have compromised in Kuje prison. Don't you people know about that? Or you people are daft that you can't even read the common letter on the wall. Are you getting my pot asari dogobo? That is what I want you to know to clear for you. You make you use you this or you just make it here. That Mazen Namdekan, when you say 21 kids or 27, Mazen Namdekan have million kids. Even though on people that they never born already, self, unborn kids, he still have them. You see kids are on the street of Biafra shouting Mazen Namdekan is another savior. Who are those kids? They are kids to Mazen Namdekan. We that even though we are adult already, that even though Mazen Nandekan, maybe Mazen Nandekan, he's my elder, he seniored me, but I know that he can't be my father. Because with my age, Mazen Nandekan can't be my father, but I am his son. Now, do you understand what I'm saying? I am his son to Mazen Nandekan because he is my leader. And there's no two ways about it. And that is the truth, simple and short. All this unity, your unity. Unit, you are seeing all the whole places. Even though when you come here in Germany, I don't know how many units we have. All these people are royal to Mazen Namdekan. So do you think, even though all these people, they are going against the structure of Mazen Namdekan, 
are still coming up and still telling you that they are royal to him. So what are you talking about this age, Jasari? What are you saying? Age be that. What are you saying? It's you. What are you saying? What do you want to tell me? And I, this is a challenge. But I hope our leader will never go there at all. But I want to tell you that if our leader need a private jet, we will get him a private jet within a seven days. Seven days. Seven days. Only one thing is about if he did not open his mouth and say it. I'm telling you common religious leaders that have a capacity of a, maybe a capacity of 10,000 congregations are having a, a jet fighter. A capacity of 10,000 having a jet fighter. Talk less of a man that have a capacity of millions. Hey, my great people, freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, my great people all, all over the world. This is what I bring to you today. And I hope you people will share this video. I, if this video can get to Asari Dokumbo, I will love it. That means when people begin to share it. And I think we will add a lot of things on this video. Even though try to add Ezebida next to this video, I will tell the man, technical on the ground, we have to, I have a picture of AZ, a black AZ, that one that we used to see like in Bida before, because that's kind of AZ in Bida. But I don't think that that's AZ in Bida is still remained today. But when you go to Bida by then, maybe 40, 50 years ago or 30 years, you will see some AZ in Bida that all their body is dark. They have turned to black because actually we are not black people. We are color people. We are, we are light in complexion. You see, we are yellow. We are brown. Not black. But this is that I want to tell you now. It has turned to black. I will put it next to this video. So that by the time, by the end of the day, Asadi Dokumbo will get this video. So that he will know that I have already debunked him. The, 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 the jealousy and the, and the criminal act in Asadi Dokumbo. That is exactly what I just gave to you. I salute you great people of Biafra. Freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, my great people all over the world. I still remain the Biafra and Shadi watching like a Maso Kejuku. The general. I am under command and control. IPOB is our family. VOS is the highest office of this movement. And Amazon Namdekano is our leader and the highest commander. All these three things that I mentioned, I, the Bia franchise, must defend it jealously. And you should go and tell Asari Dukubo he should shut up his mouth because I have busted them. I have busted him by sending people from coastal region, our brothers from coastal region, down to hinterland of Biafra to begin to kill their own brother. And now we have busted him, he begin to shout because he cannot take it, he cannot, uh, uh, he can't because he is, everything is open. That is the mission they have gone to, the level they have got into with that Iberiman in Finland that they always call in our leader and they thought that this guy is supporting our leader. Now do you know? Now if you don't know, now you begin to know that we know all these things. But you know people sometimes they will just overlook all these things, ignore it, trying to go a place that they will be gossiping. I don't gossip, I don't do saga. I, am, I believe in reality. Tell my people how it is. Let them think about it or thought about it and come in their own conclusion the way I always do. Because I thought about everything I'm saying, think about it deeply and before I would bring it out to my people. I salute you all once again. Mazin Nam I salute you. Mazin Shike I salute you. All the whole DOS, I don't want to be mentioning them because I don't know all of them. If I mention some part of people, if I don't do others, it seems that I'm doing pacha. No, I will only salute Mazishi Kedozian because he is the head of the DOS. Mazi Namkana, I salute you. Mazishi Kedozian, I salute you. The whole DOS, I salute you all. IPOB, I salute you. May Shuko Kikabi, I guide and protect every one of you. Guide our leader Mazi Namkana, protect him. Guide the Kano's family. Guide the DOS, Shuko Kikabi, please. Guide IPOB in worldwide, anywhere they reside, please. Bless them and guide them. Help them in everything they need. Give them that strength to walk so that they can be able to live fine. We pray. We don't beg. Everything our prayer is to command and ask. 
That is what we're here. He said we should ask that that should be given to us. You never tell us to beg. That is why I'm saying that you must bless the children of Chukwu Kikabiyama, which is Biafran people. Chukwu Kike bless IPOB. Chukwu Kike bless the Biafran people. Bless Mazen Namikano. Bless Kano's family. Bless the OS. Bless IPOB. And Chukwu Kikabiyama, please, don't forget to bless Mazo Kichuku, the Biafran child. I salute you. Till we see you again. Thank you, my people. He said, he said, he said.